What's going on everybody? Before we get into things, as always, be sure to like this video and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already so you can keep up with the newest uploads on the channel. Have you ever heard of Herschel Carrasco of Pachuco Tattoo in California? Carrasco's been tattooing for over a decade, but he began tattooing NBA players in 2017. Now, he's the artist behind some of the league's most recognizable ink, including works on Kyle Kuzma, LaMelo Ball, and Brandon Ingram. It wasn't always this way. If you look at a photo of the 1992 Dream Team, you'll see few, if any, visible tattoos, let alone giant pieces. Fast forward to the 2020 Olympics and it's a completely different story. Between Dame Lillard whose arms are completely covered in ink and Jason Tatum whose back tattoo peeks out over the shoulder of his jersey, tattoos seem to be the norm. Part of the culture shift in the league has been a product of tattoos becoming more mainstream in general. A lot of players have gotten tattoos coming into the league only to replace them with nicer ones once they have the money to do so. It's not just the amount of ink that's changing, but also where players are getting them. Leg and knee tattoos have become more popular. Herschel Carrasco says it's because once you do your arms, you typically run out of space and that's obviously just another place to go. The way NBA players get tattooed is also slightly different than how the general public does it. With more money, players often request artists to travel to them rather than the other way around. Derrick Rose, for example, once flew his artist out to Arizona so he could replace some older tattoos he got when he first entered the league. Years ago, Carrasco was invited to a penthouse with a few young Lakers at the time, including Brandon Ingram, Kyle Kuzma, Thomas Bryant, and Vander Blue. He said wherever he goes, he tends to bring a backup artist because he's learned that one tattoo can generally turn into many. He initially just went to ink up Thomas Bryant, but once he arrived, everybody else wanted in too. There's also an Instagram account, at InkedNBA, with over 150,000 followers dedicated to new ink that players get. Some people go as far as to copy their favorite tattoos from the page. Herschel Carrasco still remains to be the go-to guy for a lot of players, but there are several other artists out there that do great work. You can follow Inked NBA to check out some of the tattoos. Comment below which players have your favorite tattoos, either past or present. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe, as well as follow League Alerts on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter for the best NBA coverage out there.